Bob, Mike, welcome to Sydney. And Bob, firstly, congratulations on the birth of Bobby Jr. How did that go? It went well. Yeah, uh, really smooth uh, delivery. You know, we were kind of on pins and needles all December because uh, she was so far along, so we didn't know when it was going to come. Every time there was a contraction, we were grabbing the bags and going right to the car. But uh, it came uh, Christmas Eve, which was, uh, was a nice Christmas present for, for both of us. And uh, he's doing well, cute baby. It was, it was just so tough to leave, you know, after only a week. How's Michaela as a big sister? Great. Um, a little jealous at times, but for the most part, she's really gentle with them. Um, um, loving sister. How are you guys possibly going to top last year? It's going to be tough. Uh, you know, we had a, probably our best season of our career last year. Uh, got to start off hot. We got to, uh, you know, play well down here. The Aussie Open, which we uh, love so much. Uh, we're just uh, getting back together. I haven't seen this guy in five weeks. So uh, it's our first practice uh, today on the courts. It's starting to feel, feel good again, and, and uh, we'll start gelling pretty soon. <laughs> when you don't see each other for five weeks, how do you sort of keep in touch on the workouts, the practice? Yeah, I mean, uh, a lot of FaceTime. FaceTime probably the first thing in the morning before, uh, before breakfast. He tells me how hard he's working. I tell him how hard I'm working. He, you know, he uh, shows me that he's having a lot of fun. He goes to the Heat games, the Dolphin <laughs> games. So he, he's selling his place. I'm selling my place. Um, but, you know, uh, you know, he's got his guys. We had great practices. Uh, we're ready to go. How do you enjoy playing in Australia? Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, we love it. It's good weather. Um, the fans here are really knowledgeable about tennis. They love doubles, which is, which is great. They've, you know, got that rich history of, of doubles champions throughout the years. And, um, yeah, we just feel at home. And, um, I don't know, it reflects on our results. Um, had good runs here. Everyone's happy in a good mood. Um, they've had time at home, so everyone's refreshed. And um, yeah, want to want to show how hard they've worked, and you know that they're going to start the year hot. It's a few new teams, and some people reuniting this year. Who do you think could be a threat to your dominance at the top this year? You know, uh, it, it's going to be fun to see uh, Nestor and Zeminich rekindle uh, their partnership. You know, they had such a great two years. Uh, they're probably our biggest rivals for those two years and as we were surprised when they split up. So, uh, you know, they're two years older and they've, how many years, have they, they've been gone for three, uh, three, three, yeah, three or four years. Um, so, you know, if they start off hot um, and they don't get on each other, <laughs> you know, it, it, uh, it could be a great uh, year for them. Um, and then there's a, a lot of new teams, like Lynn Stead's playing with Melser. Uh, we play him first round here. Um, Takao and uh, Roger, they're gonna make a good team. And then you got the Indopac Express uh, back at it. So uh, it's, it's going to be fun to see these teams get back together and uh, see what they can do.